right, guys, if you want to learn more about mindset training and you want to watch all the modules, you can go to my school link that's inside the bio right here in this YouTube video. Click the link, sign up, and we're going to drop bombs on every single module on how to change your mindset, how to change the confidence that you have right now in yourself and why you don't have it and what it's going to take in order to create the person that can walk in the room and believe it's possible for yourself. This is over six figures worth of knowledge dropped in these modules right here. Join our school community and I look forward to seeing you on the other side. You have to see it in order to believe it. So the way that you open your mind is you start by one, surrounding yourself with the right people, but you also can start surrounding yourself by the right people by reading books, by listening to podcasts, by watching content like this, so that you can absorb what successful people talk about, so that you can start to shift the mindset. And most of the time, people don't believe that it's possible for them. And that's because of the way they've been raised, from their parents, their grandparents, from the circle that they surround themselves with. And so you have to start to relieve yourself from the presence of those people in order to conceptualize that it's possible for you. So whether that's money, whether that's your physique and your fitness, whether that's just creating some more confidence for yourself, through changing that your mindset that it's possible for me. I can do this. If I implement these strategies, I can do this. Waking up every morning with a PMA, which is positive mental attitude, is gonna ultimately deploy you into the future and become successful, right? It's gonna skyrocket you to success. But how do we do that, Austin? How do we change our mindset? Well, the first thing that I do in the morning is I change my mindset by shifting it to I'm very grateful. I'm grateful for where I'm at. I'm grateful for the fact that I am alive today. I have another opportunity to go. Whether I can right my wrongs, whether I was a rude person yesterday or I shouldn't have yelled or I had an angry attitude with my wife or even maybe you guys have a past history of being a person that's stolen, cheated, lied, and you've gone down this path where you feel horrible about it, but you repeat the cycle over and over and over and you think that you're a castaway, that you think that you can't right all of your wrongs. Well, that's not correct. Today is the day and you can start over and you can become the person that you wanna be. Maybe you're just a person that struggles with getting to the next level. Hey, what's up guys? Austin Hancock here. I get a lot of messages asking for some help in some capacity, whether it's financial, fitness, mindset, something to make your life better, something to make it to where you can go from this point right here, where you are now, to the dream life that you've always wanted to be live in, shoot me a text or give me a call. 405-697-4072. The number's right here. 405-697-4072. Call or text the number and let's change your life. And you have these limiting beliefs. You have this confidence issue. You blend into the room when you're in the room. Well, today's the day that you can change. And we're going to start with very simple processes in order to change our mindset. Well, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna follow through with what we say we're gonna do. And for me, I always start with fitness, right? If I say I'm gonna wake up early in the morning and go to the gym, I wake up early in the morning and I go to the gym. So it can even be, I'm not gonna eat the cake at this party. I'm not gonna drink alcohol anymore. I'm not gonna smoke cigarettes anymore. I'm not going to say these words out loud anymore. Those simple things like that are gonna be what changes your perception of you. And once you start building confidence in you is when you start to adjust your mindset because now you're gonna believe that it's possible for you because I've already changed who I am. I've already been able to lose those 10 pounds because I showed up to the gym every day even though I didn't want to. That's strengthening your mental muscle right there. Even if it's starting with a walk. I got up in the morning, I woke up before 6 a.m. before the sun was up and I went outside and I went on a one mile walk. That's a great start to adjusting your mindset because you would be amazed at if you leave your phone at home or you don't answer any calls during that walk, what you start to cultivate in your own mind. So now you're on this walk and you start to think, wow, what do I want my future to be like? How what do I got to do today? How can I handle these problems? Your mind will fix these problems. You'll start to see solutions. You'll start to create these neuro pathways to success because you can believe it because you started with that one thing. So now you've got one win under your belt. Actually, you've got two wins under your belt because you woke up when you said you were gonna wake up, you went on the walk or you went to the gym or you started to move your body and your blood flow and now you've got blood flow and the blood flow hits your brain and now you're like, dude, I feel good. And so the mindset, when you start to change those little things, 
you'll start to believe the next thing. So the walk leads to the reading of the book. The reading of the book leads to an act, a plan about a business or to how to get better at sales or how to get better at real estate or whatever you do in your own job and your own daily thing. How to be a better father if you're a father. How to be a better husband if you're a husband, a wife if you're a wife, right? And so you'll start to think and cultivate, like I shouldn't have said that yesterday, today I'm not gonna say that. I'm not gonna have a negative mindset. I'm not gonna go home when I come home from this gym or I come home from this walk and I'm not going to spew all of these words to my family and be like, well, we can't do this, we can't do that, this can't afford this. No, 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 no. We're reframing and we're programming ourselves to have a different mindset. Because once you have control of what's in between your ears, your mind, that is the first step to controlling your future.